Yes, uh, this morning it has been confirmed that a sixth child from the same family has died in hospital after being pulled from a house fire in Derby last week. 13-year-old Dwayne Philpott and his brothers and sisters were asleep upstairs when the blaze began. Their father, Mick Philpott, part two, is believed to have 17 children, made vil uh, uh, valiant attempts to save them. It's incredibly sad. So this is the sixth child that has died in this fire now. It is, it is astonishing. And, and the tragedy here is, you know, we, don't, we know it was, well, the police seem to think it was done on purpose. It was accelerant put through the letterbox. They don't quite know who, who it is yet. However, this, this family became a target a couple of years ago. You know, they, they, and I suspect they have many enemies out there because they were seen to be on benefits, they were seen to be asking for a bigger council house. And I think they probably upset a lot of people at the time. Well, and they were on the TV programme with Anne Whittacombe, weren't they? Yeah, yes, it was, the yes, it was called Benefit Culture. Yeah. Well, she's come out in support of the father because he was portrayed in the media as, as being a bad father or an irresponsible father he was actually in the middle of that fire trying to save his own children I mean you know the, what, what, how braver can you be than that how better father can you be than that and Anne Whittacombe's actually come out saying that she said he wasn't a bad he's father. not a bad father but th at all. this was an accident waiting to happen there's a lot of resentment out there for, for families exactly like this especially now especially you know when, when the country's in the state that it's in and there's not much money I think people you know have seen families maybe like this one to be taking well, not advantage. necessarily an accident waiting to happen because it's not an accident if, if accelerant well, was indeed put through the letterbox which I, I, in yeah, cases you know yeah, then there's I, I kind of mean the culture of the family and the fact that they consistently did interviews about mm. their situation. And, yes. You know, they bring the attention to themselves. And this, the tragedy, this is what's happened. Well, that's, uh, Six uh, innocent uh, children have died. Along with uh, Assistant Chief Constable Steve Cotter.